I'm Richard Ryan, welcome to Rated R. In this week's episode, Exploding Arrows. The breakdown is where I take your favorite parts of movies and video games and recreate them in real life. This episode, Crisis 3. Set in New York City in 2047, Crisis 3 incorporates a ton of futuristic weaponry from the nano suit to the Typhoon that has a fire rate of 500 rounds per second. One thing that really caught my eye about the game is the Predator bow. Being that I had the proper federal licenses to experiment, I decided to make a few custom arrows for myself, filming it all with a rated RR slow-mo camera. When an RPG is launched, stabilizing fins are deployed causing it to rotate. The centrifugal motion arms the warhead, that way in theory if you hit an object too close it won't detonate. Explosive arrows on the other hand are armed before flight and detonate on impact. Compound bows like the Predator bow utilize a pulley system with cams to increase the amount of force exponentially. If too much force is exerted on the arrow it might detonate upon release, but on the other hand if there isn't enough force on impact it might not blow up. The uh, slow-mo playback is gonna be the telltale here, but there's the arrow. It looks like, yeah, it looks like the, it did detonate delayed. So what happens is I have something at the tip of the arrow, so whenever it hits, it doesn't detonate on impact. It sends it into the shaft here, which causes the primary explosive to detonate. So you get, you're supposed to get a blowout out the back here, and it looks like it did a pretty good job of blowing out the back here, so I'm curious how it looks on the slow-mo playback for the uh, actual watermelon and everything, but all in all, pretty happy with this. So instead of doing the delay detonation arrow, this one's gonna detonate on impact. So I have a very, very sensitive 1.1 explosive all the way throughout the front of the shaft here. Let's see how this thing holds up. Now that, that explosion had my own personal little concoction of explosives in the broadhead there, and there is nothing, nothing left. I mean, my, my little shooting stand here and everything is just like broken up into pieces. You know, this thing's lasted a long time. I think this has lasted the better part of a year or so with all the different types of machine guns and whatnot, but this, uh, this last explosion, it really did it in. So I would, uh, would show you guys some of the Rhine or something like that, but there's nothing. That thing just vaporized. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching guys. If you liked the video, make sure you pull that trigger on the subscribe button. Don't forget new episodes every single week right here on Rated RR. See y'all next time. Are you the hunter or the hunted? I know for damn sure which one I am. Spending that goo goo money? <laughs> yeah! <laughs>